This is an open letter to Governor DeWine. Governor. The Cuyahoga County Board of Health is lax, if not non-compliant, with enforcement of your COVID-19 mandates. They have refused to enforce social distancing at grocery stores claiming that violations cannot be helped and that they cannot enforce social distancing in the stores. In difference to your specific mandates for essential businesses they have allowed non-essential businesses such as lawnmower sales to stay open. They have allowed solicitors from non-essential businesses to canvass neighborhoods claiming they cannot follow the solicitors around. They are good on excuses but not on enforcement. As far as unemployment benefits not one person we have spoken with has been able to get through by phone to Ohio Department of Job and Family Services to address unemployment issues. As far as your small business loans that money has already run out and many businesses I have spoke with have yelled foul and fraud. Much like your tenure as Attorney General and after you and your wife met with eBay management and got their endorsement for Governor and then allowing eBay to continue to allow the influx of Chinese counterfeit Gibson and Gretsch guitars into the United States your management of COVID-19 is ineffective. In all my years of auditing and certifying management systems I have never seen such a mismanaged mess. For shame Governor. Department of Job and Family Services Office of Unemployment Insurance Operations. To continue in English, press 1. But a in readiness, please listen carefully as our menu options have changed. If you are calling to file a new claim, press 1. If you have an existing claim and need to reset your PIN in order to access your claim online, press 2. For all other questions related to your unemployment claim, press 3. For other in if you would like to check your claim and payment status using our automated system, press 1. For all other questions related to your claim, press 2. This call may be monitored or recorded. Please answer all questions honestly and correctly. Your answers will become part of your record. Ohio and federal law provide penalties for false statements to obtain benefits up to, and including, prosecution. You must have your driver's license or state ID prior to speaking with a representative. Don't wait in line. To avoid long hold times, we advise you file online at unemployment.ohio.gov. You may file online 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, 365 days a year. We are currently experiencing a high call volume and processing a record number of claims. This has slowed processing times and caused our system to post some correspondence notices in error. The answers to many questions can be found on our website, unemployment.ohio.gov. Currently, we are at least one week behind schedule in both processing claims and distributing payments. If you are eligible for unemployment, all benefits will be retroactive to the date you first qualified. Any delays in processing will not affect your total benefit amount. If your claim is identified as needing to be backdated, you will receive an email with more information. If you are experiencing issues with resetting your PIN online due to issues with a website performance, please wait and try again later. If you receive automated notices about work search activities or Ohio means jobs, please ignore them. We apologize for any confusion as we build capacity and implement new programs. Thank you for your patience during this challenging time. We are currently experiencing an exceptionally high call volume. Please try again at another time, or if you have access to a computer, visit unemployment.ohio.gov. From this website you can apply for benefits, file weekly claims and obtain other information about the unemployment program. We apologize for any inconvenience. To repeat this message, press the star No key. one that we have spoken with has been able to get through to the Ohio Department of Job and Family Services. Everyone has been getting this canned response. There is no option for a callback or even email interaction to resolve unemployment compensation issues. For shame Governor. For shame, I have scanned through the Cuyahoga County Board of Health website and could not find one document that defined the specific requirements for what is considered an essential business. If the Cuyahoga County Board of Health was tasked with overseeing the Governor's COVID-19 requirements should this not have been defined in any of these documents? So it appears that the Cuyahoga County Board of Health is shooting from the hip with no real guidance document on essential businesses. I suggested a checklist and was arrogantly told they could not implement the document. I scanned the Summit County Board of Health website and they have well-defined requirements for essential businesses as well as an effective online COVID-19 complaint reporting system. 
for shame.